Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Gizmo Joe. Today we're going to be taking a look at a pair of wireless headphones by Billy K, I think is how you pronounce it. It's B-I-L-I-K-A-Y or Billy K. I don't, I don't know. Anyway, you can get these guys on Gearbest for an insanely cheap price. And, uh, you know, I've, I've been messing around with headphones. Um, if you guys watch the channel, uh, you know that I recently did a couple videos on um, active noise canceling headphones by Empow, which I was really impressed with. Uh, so, uh, you know, the Empow headphones packed a lot into an incredibly cheap price. They, you know, were about 50 bucks. So I wanted to get something that was super cheap to see how they kind of stacked up because I was really impressed by what Empow was offering for, you know, what they were charging um, compared to some of the bigger guys like, uh, you know, Beats and um, Bose and Sony and stuff where, you know, those headphones can run hundreds of dollars. Empow is, you know, undercutting them significantly. And I was really, really impressed with the build quality, the sound quality, everything about them. So I wanted to go in the total opposite direction from some of the bigger guys and get something dirt cheap. So as you can see in front of me is the Billy K uh, headphones. Now let's just take a look at this box because it looks amazing. All right, uh, you have this sort of like, uh, well, first of all, this is like a, a cardboard slip here. So the model that we're talking about is the VJ033. All right, um, it's got some amazing things written on it. So it says high quality audio. Okay, great, fine, awesome. Um, this, I will, <laughs> be amazed if that actually says music on the side of these headphones. Um, I am hoping, fingers crossed. Anyway, um, it says here, very proudly, um, and it's hard to tell because it's in some sort of like, I don't know, shiny embossment, but it says can be folded. Great, awesome, love that, portability, it's excellent. We flip it over here, it says can be folded. Uh, what's this say here? Uh, this says create hi-fi sound quality wireless headphones by pursuing earth sound experience. Not sure what that means, but hey, you know what? I'm not gonna knock it. Um, over on the side here, APTX high quality audio. I don't know if that's a thing. Uh, maybe if you guys you know, know a little bit more than me, you can mention it in the comments. Uh, and it basically says the same thing about the earth sounds or whatever. Uh, flick it over onto the back. Uh, it says here that you're looking at Bluetooth uh, 5. Uh, transmit range, so this is your wireless range. It's about 10 meters. I guess that's about, uh, you know, part of the course, I guess. Uh, it says here, support software agreement. Not sure what this stuff means either. Um, if somebody does know, let me know in the comments. Uh, so you got a lithium battery on the inside. It's 500 milliamp hours, so pretty decent. Uh, charge time, they say it's about an hour till it's fully charged. Talking time, so I guess it's got a built-in mic but uh, you're looking at 10 hours and music playing time, 10 hours. Uh, so pretty pretty good. Um, and I should preface this before I go any further. You can get these guys for about 15 US dollars on gearbest.com, um, which is insanely cheap. So uh, let's take a look at them. I don't have high hopes, but we'll see. Um, so let's see here. Uh, we got this little guy here. Open that up. I'll put this off to the side. Um, so the headphones are there. What's this here? All right, so we have what well, looks like a 3.5 mil cable. So you must be able to use these in a wired capacity as well. And then you also have a micro USB charging cable. So uh, you charge the internal battery up by the micro USB. You can use it uh, wired with the 3.5 mil cable. So that's handy as well. Anyway, um, the packaging is, you know, it's it's, not great. So, I mean, again, they're 15 bucks. So, you know, temper your expectations. Let's uh, pull this off. All right, so here these guys are. So you can see that they're blue. First of all, I will say they are incredibly light. Uh, they do not have a whole heap of weight to them, uh, but they do fold, which is, which is nice. So it gives a nice satisfying little click. It does sort of feel like I'm gonna break them though when I do, so I mean, it's, it's not great. Oh, that's great. It literally says music. Wireless headphones, VJ033. Okay, I'm not gonna knock it again. I know I'm, I sound like I'm being condescending, but let's let's be honest. These guys are 15 bucks. They're coming out of China. I don't have high expectations. Anyway, um, so you can see here, 
uh, that they are just, you know, standard sort of headphones. They're not active noise canceling. Even though it does say on the GearBest website that they're noise, um, I don't think they say canceling. They say something else, but it's, you know, implying that it somehow blocks out sound. Uh, there is no noise canceling feature on here as far as I can tell. Um, but anyway, let's just take a look at what is on this guy. So here uh, you have your 3.5 mil jack. So that uh, can be used in a wired capacity. You have your micro USB charging port. Uh, this is an interesting feature. So this is a micro SD card. So uh, if you load music up on a micro SD card, pop it in here, you can essentially just use these guys as standalone um, you know, headphones. You don't have to have another device connected to it in order to listen to music. I thought that was an interesting feature. Um, although because there's no screen, I guess it just functions sort of like an iPod shuffle or something where you can just hit the next track button and it will just play them um, like that, I guess. I'm not really sure. Um, but anyway, you have your power button, play button. It also functions as a pause button. You also have a volume rocker, which doubles as a track uh, skip uh, sort of button, so you can go back or forward. Um, you have a equalizer button here. I'm not really sure what that does. And then you have a uh, you have the little phone icon on this last button, so you can answer phone calls. So if you are connected. Um, to your phone via Bluetooth, you get a call coming in, you can press that button and you should be able to answer the call, which is, uh, you know, handy. Um, anyway, just as far as the build quality is concerned, like I said, it's all plastic, it feels pretty lightweight, uh, doesn't feel fantastic, but I mean, you know, it does feel like, you know, it's not like they're gonna come apart in my hand or anything like that. Um, yeah, you have some soft bits here. It actually feels pretty good to the touch, you know, the cups here. Um, feel all right, not quite as premium as like the MPALs that I recently took a look at, but you know, they'll suffice. I feel like they wouldn't necessarily be that irritating on your ears, which is good. Um, and yeah, I mean, other than that, they're plastic. They're, you know, they feel cheap and it's because they were cheap, but um, you know, they're not terrible, um, at least as far as the build quality is concerned. Now, um, one of the things I really like about these guys is that if you press the power button, you'll notice that, <laughs> first of all, you have your, it goes straight into Bluetooth pairing mode and um, it pairs really, really quickly. So um, I paired this to my phone earlier and um, it paired like that. Um, so I've had cheaper Bluetooth devices before where it's a pain to try to connect them to stuff. I will say that this is, uh, something that the Billy K VJ033 does really well. It pairs very quickly. Um, and what you'll notice here is that it says music. And uh, I mean, I hate this sort of stuff, but you know, it says music, wireless headphones, VJ033. And it kind of cycles through these different tones. It's kind of a nice touch that makes it, I guess, uh, seem a little bit more expensive than they actually are. To me, it's kind of tacky. It's not really what I'm into. Uh, that being said, I mean, if you're going to just use these at home and you're not like out in public or anything like that, um, I don't think, you know, I, look, you want to wear these out in public and have these things glowing music. I mean, that's fine. That's, that's your prerogative. No problem. I don't have an issue with that. Um, but for me personally, I don't have that sort of self-confidence. So, um, I probably wouldn't be wearing these outside, but inside it's fine. Now, full disclosure, I've already opened these guys up, obviously paired them to my phone and had to listen. I was actually pretty surprised with the sound quality. I thought the sound quality was gonna be absolute garbage, but it's not terrible. It's definitely listenable. I would say that uh, the bass range of your music doesn't come through great. It's a bit muddy, it's a bit muffled. Um, but other than that, I mean, it's perfectly serviceable. I mean, especially if you're just gonna use these, uh, I mean, if you're listening to podcasts or just watching YouTube videos or whatever, I mean, you shouldn't have any qualms with these. Uh, again, music wise, if you're an audiophile, you like your high fidelity music, you're gonna you know, pick these guys apart because they just don't have the sort of drivers that higher quality headphones have. That being said, for 15 bucks, if you are looking for over the ear headphones that uh, aren't gonna cost a fortune, I mean, these guys are worth a go. I mean, like I said, they're 15 US dollars, super cheap. They pair very easily and very quickly with your device. And the sound quality is not that bad. Anyway, that's gonna do it, guys. Uh, that's the Billy K 
VJ033 wireless headphones. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, I really appreciate it. I hope you guys are all staying safe, uh, washing your hands, all that sort of stuff. And I will catch you next time. This is Gizmo Joe signing off.